Hello, fellow wholehearted high achievers. Welcome to Hang with Hang. What a beautiful day right behind me. My gosh. So today I am going to share with you my perspective on how to stop the negative self-talk. Now, as high achiever, this is a very common trap that we all get caught up in because you're so good in expecting yourself, right? And then when you don't meet, meet that expectation, you start beating yourself up. And there's so many narratives. Now, I know that the solution out there, there's a lot of solution out there to say positive information, to say nice thing about yourself, to have gratitude. Yes, there's a place for that. But here's my take on this in the, in the order of things based on my own experience, based on my experience of helping others over the years is first is to lay it out. You got to connect to what is it that you are saying to yourself? Shine a light on it. What is it that you don't like yourself? I do not like my hair. I am a horrible girlfriend, I'm not a good daughter, whatever it is, lay it out. That's the first thing. Second thing is to identify the feeling of each of the items you lay it out. Where is it in your body? You connect to it because chances are it's caused a negative pain in your body. And this is where with my client, I teach them EFT and how to clear it. Maybe I'll make a separate video on it. But for the sake of this, what you can do next is that you put a hand in, your, in where that pain is you bring it into existence, even though I do not like my hair, I accept myself. Now, for some of you, that may not be true. So you don't want to make bullshit up either. If you cannot accept yourself, then don't say it. You could say, even though I do not like that, I'm a horrible girlfriend, and possibly down the road, I will accept myself. And by doing that, your system will calm down. And then after, it's calmed down to neutral. You want to get to the point where you can say it out loud, you connect to that thought, and it's no longer have an emotional charge for you. And then you can move on to gratitude. You can genuinely move on to what are you grateful for about yourself. And then you can list out all the positive things that you that about yourself that is true. Now, it's very important that you're not just making stuff up that is not true. Because basically, you just create more lies to your system. What you want is you want to connect to what is the shadow side and you want to connect to what is on the great side. Because here's the thing. As human, in this meat package or this protein body, we have the amazing thing that we love about ourselves and we have things that we don't like about ourselves. And the key is to not just live here. The key is to embrace this and also acknowledging this because they both are there and they both are equally important and they both deserve your love and your attention. All right, so that's my take on it of how to stop your negative self-talk. Uh, I would be curious of what your insight is. You can share in the comment below. If you haven't already, please subscribe and then set notification. And then when we have the next video, we'll, let you, we'll send it to you. And if you feel this is helpful, please share this to as many hearts as possible. For now, I'm sending you the ocean vibe, the healing vibe from Hawaii, from my heart to yours and wherever you are in the world. Much love and until the next authentic moment, my friend. Mwah.